Forty here for another episode of A Seat Apart Real Reviews. And on today's show, we're going to review the movie The Book of Eli. Brought to us by Alan and Albert Hughes, uh, twins that brought us Dead Presidents, Menace to Society, and From Hell. Two great movies right there. <laughs> Read between the lines. Uh, this one was an absolutely awesome movie starring Denzel Washington, Gary Oldman, of course, playing the villain. Mila Kunis in a role that you might not recognize her in is a serious role because a lot of people know her from uh, some comedic roles that she's played. And Jennifer Beals from Flashdance. I'll tell you, she was great in this movie. So up first, we're going to see what the IA, Maddie W. Kelly, had to say about The Book of Eli. The Book of Eli. You out there would probably think I wouldn't see this movie because it actually has the word book in it. And I hate reading. But this movie was tremendous. I've seen 10 movies so far this year, and I'm telling you, probably throughout the entire year, this will probably be in my top five films. This movie is great. Denzel Washington nails it again. He's a fabulous actor. And let me tell you, Mila Kunis, beautiful girl. Beautiful girl. I didn't think I'd like her in this role, but she was great. And what a great body on her, too. There's a couple little twists in this film that I'm telling you, when you walk out of the theater, you're going to be like, holy smokes, I did not expect that for the life of me. And that pretty much makes this film work the way it did. It was a great, great film. I don't want to say too, too much about it because I'd like you all to go out and see it and enjoy it for yourselves. So I'm going to have to send it on back to PFF, my buddy, Paul Frederick Foddy. Back to you. Maddie, thank you very much for that excellent review. When the Hughes brothers heard that you were going to review their film, they almost called it the movie of Eli. <laughs> Uh, but I couldn't agree with you more. Mila Kunis, spot on. She was great. Uh, nothing else can be said about Denzel and Gary Oldman. Colin, what did you think about the movie of Eli? The book of Eli. First off, Denzel Washington, I mean, he's such a badass. When he tells you he's going to do it, and then you pop off at the mouth, and he does exactly what he just told you he's going to do, he's unbelievable. This guy is one of the best actors on the planet. And the Hughes brothers are back. They're almost as popular as another two brothers I know in Hollywood. They're up, but they're getting there. They're almost as high as uh, you know who I'm talking about here, boys. And uh, one other thing, I, everyone touched on Mila. I mean, I have to touch on it too. And I want my producer, I'm gonna actually turn to the side. If you could just cue one more good shot of her, somewhere right around this frame. And, I mean, somewhere right around this frame. You can work with that, and uh, that's about it. This movie was sensational. Check it out, post-apocalyptic. <laughs> Back to you. <laughs> that's apocalyptic, by the way. Apocalyptic. Uh, and by the way, I also wouldn't mind touching on Mila Kunis, if you know what I mean. And I also don't know if you're talking about Randy and uh, Dennis Quaid. The Farrelly brothers? The Cohen brothers? I certainly hope you didn't mean the Kelly brothers. <laughs> but anyway, excellent review for an excellent film, The Book of Eli. And uh, touching back on Maddie's comments earlier in the movie, this is one of the movies that I did see a second time and actually liked it just as much, if not better, the second time. Don't want to give you any spoilers, so spoiler alert. So until next time, I'm Paul Forty for A Seat Apart Real Reviews.